Welcome everyone. For today's video, I've put in my simple guide on how to install and play solo leveling Arise on your PC. I have received a few comments recently asking what platform you can play this on, how to install it, and the like. So I decided to create a simple guide for you guys. Let's jump right in. First, let's go to the official website. I will put down the link in the description below. So as you can see here, this is what I will normally see when I open it, since I'm located where early access is not yet available. In order to download the game, we're going to download a free VPN. Let's open a new tab and just search for Winscribe. Click on the first link, then after that, click on download at the top. This is also available for Mac OS, just go ahead and click download. Since I already have it, I'm going to cancel here, and once it's done, just install it. Winscribe is easy to use and has 2 gigabytes of free data every month, but once you register, it upgrades you to 10 gigabytes, which resets every month, as you can see in my account here. All right, let's open Winscribe and click the turn on icon. You can see it's already set to Vancouver here. I chose it simply because it has the best signal out of the options. You can select the location in the drop down below. Select Canada to play early access and choose the location with the best signal. In my case, that's Vancouver. After that, go back to the official website and hit refresh. Voila! So the pre-registration is gone, and now you have entered the Early Access website. We'll just click on the PC version, then click Download Now. I'm going to cancel that, since I already have it installed, but once you download it, just install it and follow these simple instructions to install the Netmarble Launcher. Next, open the launcher and click on Solo Leveling on the left side. It will ask you to download when you first access this, but in this case, let's go ahead and click Play. Let me sign in real quick, and done. It will download 8 gigabytes worth of resources for first-time players, which might drain your Winscribe data allowance, which was my mistake the first time. But let me teach you a simple trick to bypass this. As you can see, the game is very slow when loading on the game screen. It's because I still have my Winscribe on. You can actually turn that off as soon as you open the game, so it should run at your normal internet speed. Even if the website reverts back to the pre-registration screen, you can still hit play on the game launcher. That's it for today's video. If you find my guide useful, consider subscribing to our channel. I'd love to hear your thoughts or feedback in the comments below, and don't forget to like this video and hit the bell icon for updates. Your support means the world to us. Thanks for tuning in. Happy gaming!